up there. It's pretty good. Colombian coffee. It's pretty good. You try it. Billy just left for Sydney and he's gonna stay there for three days. I didn't really plan on what I'm gonna do while he's gone, but I have Amazon Prime. So I'm probably just gonna watch some stuff and then I have a couple of boxes that I haven't unboxed. They're both cabinet stuff so i'm probably gonna unbox that and try to build it myself and today i'm gonna go with mega just hang out get some coffee sit in a cafe had some brunch i'm not sure but yeah that's just the plan for today and i might do a little bit of cleaning because this place is a mess i'm a mess i don't know <laughs> i guess i'm just gonna play by ear but yeah, I'm going to try to record everything that I'm gonna do while Bill is not here. And I guess that's it. Okay, I was actually about to unbox these boxes but the place that me and Mega was supposed to be at turns out to be super far from me so I decided to just get ready and 
right now I'm going <laughs> bye love see you later So, a little bit of the background about the place that we are about to go. This place is called Hippie and it looks like it's a Japanese kind of cafe. It looks really good. I can't wait to try it. So, yeah. But it's a real pain in the ass to get there. I have to take one tram, three trains and probably walk a little bit and it's going to take me about an hour so hopefully everything's gonna be great there coffee's gonna be great, food's gonna be great I'm just excited to see Mega and it's coming up. right was seriously scary but I'm close now I'm here finally Ooh, the place looks good a well spent afternoon oh I'm sorry if the sun is quite striking but yeah it was really nice seeing Mega and Iskandar and just spent our whole afternoon wait a second 
Initially, our plan was just to visit Hibiki, but turns out we had an impromptu to go to the Four Kilos Cafe, and that was really good too. And while we were there, there was this girl. She was working. She came to us and said hi, and then she said that she was watching my videos. It was so nice of her to came up to me, just having a chat, asking if the coffee was okay and if we enjoy our experience in four kilos which we really did the thing was we were so full from hibiki but we were kind of forcing ourselves through to go to visit four kilos but yeah the place was really cool really simple minimalistic i love their working environment everyone was seems so chill so lovely so nice so cheerful and all of them were girls <laughs> it was really nice really good ambience and overall 9 out of 10 <laughs> right now i'm just walking back home i decided to just walk from flinders because i felt so sleepy in the tram and i don't want to go back to the apartment feeling sleepy so i decided to walk back home now i feel quite refreshed and hopefully I can do some stuff and not fall asleep on the couch. Wish me luck. It's kinda crazy. Copy. The kinds of things life throws at you. Never knew I'd feel so safe in your arms. Now you're all I need. It wasn't long before I knew that I fell for you and you had my heart. As fast as the seasons change, my heart was stolen. Parts of me that were. Alright, so the last time I vlogged was yesterday. After I arrived home, I tried to fit in some editing and then I cooked salmon for dinner and then I slept. Today, I woke up quite early in the morning. I went all the way to Doncaster to meet my friends and just catch up with them. And here I am back at home again. I just finished my dinner, which is the same from yesterday. And then I tried to build one of the cabinet that I've been saying that I wanted to build. I think I kind of succeed, which makes me quite happy. But the aftermath it's quite messy now but i don't know if i want to clean right now i want to just wash up and just get ready for bed because tomorrow i'm going to work again our long weekend has come to an end guys i'm so sad every time i had quite a long day off i've always felt like i don't want to go back to work ever again <laughs> <sighs> one day when i quit my barista job i really hope that none of you are gonna be sad but i really hope that you guys can be happy for me because i don't want to be a barista for the rest of my life but yeah if you guys are still supporting me and all of the content that i put out on youtube hopefully soon enough i can step away from my first job and yeah i just do my own thing i'm not sure i'm not sure sorry if i talk too much right now but yeah i hope you guys have been having a wonderful wonderful long easter weekend and yeah let's just power through the next few days so that we can get to the weekend again <laughs> All right, I'm gonna head on to bed now. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week. <laughs> they look exactly... <laughs> of things
things life throws at you I never knew I'd feel so safe in your eyes